किया वेलकम गाइज वेलकम बैक टू दैनल दिस इज योर होस्ट पब्रिक्शा एंड टूडे वी गो टॉक अबाउट विच इज बीन क्रिएटेड बाई फोर डिफरेंट यूट्यूबर्स टूडे आई वॉज वॉचिंग द यूट्यूब आफ्टर द ब्रायन ए एम ए सो आई वॉन्टेड टू सी वॉट इज द रिएक्शन ऑफ दैट ए एम ए ऑन द Uh, on the on the fathers what they going to say about it so especially i watched almost multiple different videos but i found that there are some fathers who are still fighting on the on the project so rather than making four videos on four different people i thought that i should make a one single video on all of these four fathers so fatherder number 1 so let's see what he has to say I will make them to believe a lie because they have refused to see the truth. Well, this is a passage in the Bible and this passage is applicable to you guys who think that this protocol was designed to make you money. Well, I'm not expert on the Bible, but yeah, I have a bachelor degree in commerce so I can I can tell you about the business. Well, I am earning 2x right now after 5 months and I am the day one holder not day one holder but as actually I bought it after a week but you know from that day till today I am always on 2x so I am earning money expecting new investors to come and buy safe so that they can suck their money these guys are blood suckers they want to extort money from you no sorry i have to do that we are not blood suckers we are safe family you know that safe family okay and i don't want to discuss that sucking part you know that reminds me something else so i'm not going to discuss that so that mean that dude is not understanding who are buying and who are selling well buyers are those who are new and seeking the profit and some of the buyers are those who are dcing to their bags you know they don't want it to be in a loss so they always dc at their bags they are they are good investors who know what is the value of total cost averaging and second the sellers are those who are selling their rebases and their profit which is a good thing it's a healthy thing if you want to take your profit out this is a healthy thing it's not a bad thing and the other form of sellers are those which are selling their coins just because of the fudders okay it's a simple thing okay let me show you guys something that will blow your mind and I, this is a fire pit and this is the contract address We are looking, you know, claim that he has no access. Well, this is not gonna blow my mind because I know about the fire pit since five months back. You know, I know the Brian Legend <sighs> has created a hot wallet as a null wallet. But do you know about that? This fire pit is actually a null wallet, and nobody is earning nothing from the fire pit. Fire pit is dead, like a dead meat. Okay. and this 21 million you see that cannot be taken out okay come on man come on bring at least something new so that i can make some interesting video about it they are bringing very common things you know i don't know let's move on I know I know I know you guys have your own theories and you're going to tell me the baton no you don't know shit you don't understand what is going on with this project this is wow he understand himself very well i don't have to make any argument about that or should i i always say time is on our side time will tell what is going on but You should not buy Seifu when you do not believe in Seifu. Seifu does not belong to the people who don't have any imagination. Blood sucking people who are out there to extort money from you. I bought Seifu last time. I sold it and I've never bought it again. Well, I have uh, personally completely listened to this guy that what he is saying 
entire his video when I fast forward it because I think I should not bore you anymore and should not tell you if you are very much interested then you can go and watch his video okay but uh, I try to make it short this entire video is nothing nothing else but just speculation talking about uh, the price chart and talking about the SIF you know the SIF is old uh, old old stuff you know I explained it in my videos and Brian already did it in many of many of his videos and it's five months it's functioning very much fine no problem with it as a SIFU X will come this problem will be finished after two months so there'll be no talking of the uh, fire pit anymore after two months and the second thing he was concerned about is actually the price going up and down yes there were manipulators in the price who were buying and selling and but there was also uh, genuine buyers and sellers in the project as well and some of them were selling just due to the fear you know fear of losing their more money so that's why they sold i find nothing suspicious about the chart it's almost very much systematic protocol is doing well bots are doing well the contract which is designed attached to the uh, treasury SIF and uh, um, the rest of the protocol is working very much fine the rebase mechanism is working very much fine so there is nothing to worry about i am here since five months now and i have not seen anything suspicious about the project okay this is a new youtuber and he is actually making about the ponzinomics of the drip which was his main topic and he was telling about that how that drip is ponzi based on ponzinomics and why the binance is uh, put a red flag on the drip and the drip protocol and telling to the people that this is the high risk system and it is not exactly the same the way it is it is it is uh, described by their devs so that is why they put uh, that project into the red flag so that people know that this is a high risk project and dev can take the liquidity anytime so that's the reason uh, he put it the video on the drip so as he was explaining the drip then he switched towards the uh, Seifu protocol which has nothing to do with and Binance has nothing to do with uh, with a Seifu and it is not been red flagged by the uh, by the Binance and Seifu is entirely a different protocol as compared to the to the drip drip network take all of your coins and put that into their contract and don't give you don't give you an access to all of the coins you hold and only give a one person on those coins to you well the Seifu is a free market you can DCA to your coins and you can you can buy and sell all of your coins which has nothing to do with uh, with the drip drip is entirely a different project maybe uh, he is right that it is based on ponzinomics almost it's a long debate i do not go uh, for the ponzinomic debate because that requires a different type of understanding so i am not going to go towards the ponzinomic debate but in short he wanted to tell that drip is a ponzinomic scheme so as the so if Seifu is also a ponzinomic scheme and then he quoted the dan hill uh, dan hill video on it the, in in that video he was actually explaining the wallet number four and schmidt group that they came to the brian and they were asking that we not going to give you any kind of a tax and just uh, let us in in the project and we will invest almost 38 or uh, 28 million dollars something around that and then we will not going to uh, give you any kind of a tax which the brian rejected so that was the topic he was discussing in that video he took some chunk out of it and tried to explain that uh, that Dan Hill is is providing uh, 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 is providing some kind of a uh, some kind of a ponzinomics uh, tokenomics to the people, but which actually he was not. So that was the another try. I know this guy. I know why he was doing that. Once he came in the live session, and I remember that 
uh, he asked a very uh, a very silly question from the brian he asked that why you guys are talking about <laughs> the nodes which has no utility and you are discussing the nodes so at that time brian gave him the answer there was slightly uh, he used slightly hard words that he call him uh, you know uh, the way he call in a flow so he sort of abuse him in a in a in a comic manner but i think so that's the thing he kept in his mind and he made this video uh, i tried to find that footage but uh, i couldn't find it maybe the editors of the um, of the sefu edited those chunks out of the um, uh, out of the ama but i remember that ama was about nodes and all that stuff uh, and he was the one who asked the question and Brian gave slightly hard answer. So he is making that video, I think so, just because of that. And the second thing, he don't have any, any understanding towards any kind of a protocol. So this is the another scam video I have seen. Last time when I was making about the scammers uh, a video, uh, that was the Harry money which were discussing about the airdrop of the Seifu you know what are they saying in this video is actually the real Seifu what we are holder of but uh, as I was trying to get the real facts out of it so I try to what I did it actually I give you the comparison of both of our chart and the chart which is representing in that video both of the chart have almost 98 percent similarities and this is not a coincidence what they actually did they took our chart and took a snapshot out of it from the uh, coin market cap and what they did they edited that chart and then try to explain and give you the idea that this is what is presently happening but this is not presently happening this is actually the happening of our chart when the Seifu was launched. So when the Seifu was launched, this is a very previous um, previous example. But these guys edited it and show you the last three months results and all that stuff. And, and this is a high APY and all that stuff. And try to present this video in now, now time, you know, just in August. So if you see in the video, I'll give you if... I have given you the uh, dates and all that stuff is all written you can see it so the similarity between all the dips and pumps and dumps and all the valleys and uh, all the heights and drops of the price is exactly same like the Seifu so don't fall into these type of videos this is also a scam video I told you last time the shield and the orange part have a some part missing but in this uh, thing it's also again the same white color is written so well they cannot exactly copy our logo because that is not legal so that's why they wanted to show it like our logo but it is not actually our logo he is not talking about Seifu and all that trust pad and Seifu airdrop is all written up up top of it which has nothing to do with our Seifu protocol this is also a scam video completely scam video just don't fall into that. This is also is another scam. Community member inside of Seifu right now. If you're inside of Seifu right now and you're buying these nodes, you're gonna lose your money. Please be aware. You're dealing with a criminal. You're dealing with a scammer. If you sacrifice your Seifu tokens, which is the only means you have to go into the liquidity pool to exchange them for BND. If you sacrifice your tokens you will not be able to go in the liquidity pool which means you'll never find you'll never see those bnbs ever again cool that's all i wanted to do i wanted to sacrifice you know and i don't want to get my bnb because bnb is already 50 percent down okay so i want to take my chances i wanted to go and four and five x my money that's what i want understand DeFi, and you'll understand this you'll understand that hey it's got nothing to do with me all right so that has now been gone away all right and whatever those fud on-chain crypto was creating 
in last few videos i try to give answer in my last live session and after me after me in the in the in the brian live session he also explained it uh, in the same way the way i explained it that bots and contracts are buying buying and and filling the liquidity in the market in bog and pancake swap plus it's filling the sieve for a better time to come so that we can use our liquidity to transfer our sefu to sefu x and create a new blockchain with more than a 50% start of the fire pit which will be more beneficial than a sefu so that is very much important if you want to go for a long run and sefu x is the future sefu is secondary for sefu holders sefu x will be the primary so whatever he was talking about these all wallets i also mentioned that in my in my live session that the bot is buying and brian also explained it that liquidity agreements and their routers are doing that automatically because well this is the entire lp mechanism and it works behind the sefu network and that lp mechanism is buying and selling according to the price of bnb going up and down so it try to balance itself according to the 50% remaining uh, in the pool so it it is it is the smart contract which is acting for buying and selling that's why the wallets are always same so bog has its own bots and the pancake swap is own bots all all of those are attached uh, to the buy and selling action because the entire dex is attached with a m m system so all the dex system is a m m which means all the pool are behaving auto market maker manners okay so when price go up they sell when the price go down they buy you know this what is happening buying and selling from the same wallets is just because of the lp bots and lp contracts which is working in the decks of pancake swap and box swap to gather the liquidity from the market and to evaluate 50 50 both token in the lp pools okay means in the liquidity pools okay it's very simple so if you are old guy you already know that and if you are new now you know that okay so let's move forward um and a lot of people are asking hey brian look what are the plans with the sif before sacrifice day you know um logically well the sif is designed for that action and the action is to buy safer with the funds that are that are within it and to utilize it towards liquidity so the safe point is exactly the same the way i was discussing with you guys in my last live session that safe can be used for the benefit of the liquidity and for the holders you know it will be automatically beneficial if it used for the liquidity for the both safe and safe ax both going to benefit us so at that point is Uh, pretty much same and man he himself said it so now you can see the sacrifice time would be the great time and i am waiting for that all of these misinformation providers what i am telling you about in this video all of them are misguided they don't have any qualification they don't have any education um, the people who are calling project a scam they don't even have a degree to tell you about Uh, what is scam and what is not they don't have any past experience about um, catching people in scams and all that stuff almost they don't have anything at all just besides doing this saying that we will do this we will make our archive we will do this we will do that they are just just playing with the words they don't have facts they don't have uh real they do not understand how the blockchain works they do not understand how the lp works they do not understand how the dex works they do not understand how the liquidity works they do not understand how the buy sells are 
uh, working and they do not understand and they're providing false information and spreading false information among the community and the new stakeholders which are coming in the protocol and they are buying they are spreading the fear among among the investor because some of uh, some of the investor are paper handed and new in the in the business and in the protocol and they do not also they also do not know how the protocol works so they are selling in the fear just because of that some of the prices are being getting dropped and prices are being dropped because some of the safe holder they are cashing their rebases and uh, newer people are less in uh, in in buys uh, and the people who are buying they are actually dcing to their bags and try to uh, try to stay where they want to uh, see their profits and where they want to see their their wallets and some of them are very good they are just buying they are like me just buying 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 and just just buying you know some of them are like that so that's it that was all about these four guys and that's what i can explain uh, about about them uh, i think so that would be that would be enough to explain about these guys and so if you seek more information go and check all the ma's of the brian uh, that will be the the right source to uh, to to check all the information and if you want to check more information check daniel prado he is doing uh, every single day you you can go and check uh, his channel and many of uh, other youtubers they are also doing very well so be in the community check just Many people are making videos about the Seifu and uh, the Seifu is, is doing very good and you can check my videos as well, some of the videos I have done on Seifu uh, and Seifu X both, so you can check that for cross information. What's my guy's name? I want to give him a plug right now that I was uh, watching yesterday. He's a Seifu holder, Babrik Shah. Babrik Shah yesterday was live explaining some things that he saw that he noticed about you know the trading that goes on with Seifu and this that and the other and i and i when i saw him live i clicked on there and i said wait what's going on and he was like hey oh my god look oh my god daniel Prado, how are you blah, 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 blah. which was fine it was fine but then fake brian was in there babrik shah does uh really good Seifu videos he does a great job on his on his videos like he does millions and millions of views on his youtube i forgot <laughs> I can actually show you guys this. Like, what am I doing? You know what I'm saying? Um, this is his page right here. This is Babrik and um, Babrik Shah. And he was saying um, that, you know, in his, where he's from, everybody knows him. Everybody knows his father. So he's pretty famous where he's from. I don't know where that is because again. So in the end, I want to say that I am very much thankful to the Daniel Prado that he mentioned my Seifu videos and my YouTube channel on his live session. Um, and I couldn't give him the time too much at that time because there was so many fud around and I wanted to explain things in that live AMA. Uh, but he's, he's a great person. I always see his, all of his videos. And I know him since when he was doing videos on Seifu's when he was having only 200 and 300 subscribers. I was one of them. I was watching his videos because of his his enthusiasm and his uh, his love toward the Seifu. So I just I just watch his video, all of his videos, and he's a great man. And if you want to grab some information about the Seifu, he's the right person to grab uh, your Seifu information from. Yes. So yes. thank you so much. Yes. This is your yes. host, Babrik Shah. Yes. See you in next video. Bye-bye.